Hey guys, welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I'm doing a back to school supplies haul. So I've got all my stuff bought and ready and I'm so excited to showcase it to you guys because I want to give you some inspiration if you haven't bought yours already. So I know in America you go back between mid and late August and in the UK you normally get to start at September. So I mean, if you're already back at school, you can use this next year or if you want some new supplies mid mid like midway through the year. Um, or if you haven't gone back to school yet and you haven't bought any supplies, take some advice on what I've got if you're very similar to me. So, without any further ado, let's just get on with the video. Okay, first put like a pencil case. So, I've normally had like a clear like one with like a little coloured zip. And you probably know the ones I'm talking about, a lot of kids have them. But I really want like a more fun, like gimmicky, novelty one because I've just seen me. Um, so I got this cute little sweet treat strawberry milk pencil case. It is from Tesco's and all the stationery I believe, except a few things, is from Tesco's. The bag isn't, but you know, um, if you're not familiar with what's up Tesco's, it's because maybe you don't have one near you or you're just in a country that has one. It's just basically, it's basically a British store. It's a bit like a British Walmart. We have a lot of British Walmarts. <laughs> um, actually, Asda's a Walmart. Oh yeah, I forgot that. I just forgot it was Walmart. Okay, so this is the pencil case. And this is a pencil case. There's a drink carton. And simple. It's super cute and kawaii. Very pastel. Well, it's not really pastel, but it's so cute. Honestly, I'm just like... Uh, I was when I saw this I was like I had to get it they had an orange juice version of it as well but I was like I play this one because it's great and it's many strawberries I think they do have like some other versions as well I think they have a blue version which is just like a normal milk or chocolate milk and then they have some other colour variations that you can't really get online like a lot of online stores Sally's or, like Amazon eBay if you want to get one of these guys and you have Tesco's near you or Stocksies look on amazon or ebay they have shed tons i saw loads the other day when looking for myself this is before i bought all this by the way um so so cute and i love it okay pen so at our school like we tend to like, do a lot of our own marking for our books and for our tests and stuff like that like i mean not like full-on like exams like for like our mini tests so i have these paper mate ink choice ball ballpoint ultra smooth ink pens and these are fine points, not 0.7 millimeters, and they're five and they're five pens, and there are four colours. And this is what the pack looks like. And they have reduced smearing and dries three times faster. Oh. Okay. So it has a red, a green, two blue, and a black. I tend to use red or blue pens to mark. Um I use black to write with. Some people use blue. I don't know how to use blue, but it's good to have spares. And I've also, where's my other pens going? Here we go. I've also got some Paper Mate Ink Joys Ballpoint Ultra Smooth Ink Ballpoint Pens in black. Just for writing, keeping spare. And these are not put to millimetres too, and they are five. And it also has reduced smearing and uh, smooth and reliable. I think. Okay, highlighters, okay, things I love. I always go with one highlighters. Last year I had like little lipstick ones, that's how like extra I am. But this year I've got some bog standard Tesco's ones in four colours and with a chisel tip. Just some normal colours, I mean, I don't really need many. But I wanted to get some like longer ones because I feel like they last longer. I wanted to get some pasta ones, but the shop I went to didn't stock them. And I was really sad, but there's always when these ones run out. So, I mean... Okay, next I have this pretty stick, and this is in pretty pink, and it's the pink glue stick, and it dries clear. I've got hair on it, and it just comes with one stick, and it's just, just that. I've always wanted one of these. I remember, like, when I was a kid, you used to have, like, all different colours. You used to have, like, blue ones. Sorry, I got really dry. Blue ones, green ones. You used to have, like, milk, like a rainbow of these. And I never had one, so, I mean, it's pretty cool. Okay, it goes on pink, dries pink. Oh, it, it dries pink. Okay, this might be a problem for, like, on paper. Yeah, okay. It's cute. Don't care. Okay, 
So a sharpener and rubber I have this mape maper. I can't I can never pronounce it, honestly. I've like tried to pronounce it so in the meantime. Two in one. What is it? Sharpener and uh sharpener and rubber or an eraser, so yeah. That's what I look like. It's just got a purple one. It's got a purple I got a purple one. It's just very simple. Okay, so it is a clean pencil sharpener, one hole plus a razor PVC. PV PVC free. Okay. That's what it looks like. So cute. Super cute. Oh, sharpener eraser, that's what that's what it is. I couldn't find it because mostly it was in French. Okay. Next we have these okay, oh god. Why did I bite my name? <laughs> Steidler Oh my god, it's German so I can't pronounce it. Steidler pencils Steidler Norris pencil sets. And it's also got like a little rubber and a sharpener. I love these rubbers. I have one for my drawing set and they are so good. So these are 10 high quality pencils, unbelievably break resistant, easy to erase and sharpen, which from surface to steadily managed forests and Mars plastic razor and a sharpener. And these are all HBs. Most like tests that the like, scouted computers need HBs, so I highly recommend getting a pack of HBs because if you don't Sometimes you'll be asked to bring one or asked to borrow one. And you don't want to be borrowing them secondhand pencils that have some kid chewing on them the whole lesson. Trust me, like some tests they'll say please bring a HB pencil or a certain type of pencil in because when that is kind of for like a machine or something, it won't be able to read it if it's not. So I recommend getting a pack of HPs. If you live in England, that's what they use anyway. I'm not sure if it's that same in America, but I know it is in England, so Okay. Next I have this Helix Oxford set of mathematical instruments instruments complete and accurate and it's basically a math set it's 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 gold math set i you basically need one of these um it has a small ruler but i've already got a ruler which i'll show you in a minute a oh, it comes with them two little things there i don't know what they're called i forgot what they're called completely it has a rubber a sharpener a compass wait a pair of compasses a wait is it a pair of compasses is it a compass or a pair of compasses i'm not sure a protractor and some stencils, which I'm not really sure why you need stencils, unless you're gonna try and like trace out every letter when you're writing. But yeah, um, I had like a really box under one last year, and it was really good. So and this one's really good as well. So okay, ruler. So I want to show. This is the Helix Oxford thirty centimeter folding ruler, and it folds basically in half down to fifteen centimeters. So. It's also got millimetres on it, which is really helpful when you're in math sometimes. And, yep, yeah, 30 centimetres, 100 millimetres folding ruler, and... It's, it's, wait, let me measure my pencil case. Will this fit? Even half of it will fit. Uh, my pencil case is 23 centimetres long, so it definitely fit. <laughs> okay, next we have... Oh, God, another, like, really hard for my Steidler 24 Norris colour coloured pencils, um, aka colouring crayons if you live in America, or there's colouring pencils, like pencils in England. And these are coloured pencils made from Wopex material, Wopex? Wopex? Material guarantee. High break resistant, brilliant colours, ergonomic soft surface, wood content from PEFC certified German forests. Made in Germany. I had a set of these in 12 last year and I flipping loved them and I, I can't find them anywhere and I really loved them because it was just like so smooth and just creamy I just really loved them Wait, is this one broken? oh no it's not sorry I just wanted to check um, they were so smooth they're so creamy they literally didn't did not break so and the, the one I got like the set I got like 12 pounds for 12 and I got these for like 5 <laughs> I think I got ripped off. But these are hexagonal as well, which is pretty cool. Wait, let me show you one. This is like my favourite colour in it. They're so cool. I fucking love these. Okay, next I have this. Here we go. Foil display book, A4 and 40 pockets. Basically, it's a display book. I put on like, my homework and letters in this. It has 40 pockets. I had a pink version last year, but I wanted to get a blue version because so cute um these are really helpful for like getting sticky labels like writing your subjects on them or writing a topic so if you may be doing your GCSEs or whatever test you do in America because I have no clue you literally just can write on here 
like what subject like right on there in on like a sticky label or, like stick it on like what like, subject or a topic something you're studying for and it's got 40 pockets so it's got plenty enough for the subject so it's got like a little wait like a little, little slot in thing here which i probably got some post-it notes or something like that in maybe my calculator I'm not sure yet i also haven't got a calculator because i've already got a working one from last year Okay, next I've got this NU Varsity notebook, and I has I got this last year, and I never used it. So this is what it looks like. It's just super cute. It's pretty small. I think it's A five. Not sure. It's got a shopping list like, like engraved in like something. Wait, mind me. Yeah, that's what it looks like. It's just okay. Here we go. This is an A five notebook, and it is red. It's really cute. I like it. Next, wait, no, second to last is Do What You Will Love Notebook. This is an A4 project book. I got this last year again for like doing some homework in and stuff or some drawing. I've got like a sketch pad in there. I've got some like Spanish stuff in here from last year. Um, I had some old signatures. I got some like weird herbal artwork. This is from January. That is from January. Wowzers. So my artwork in here. That last piece of artwork I did was in May. And that was my is my most like proud piece. I did it with the hat so. I've never loved this artwork. It took me ages. It's probably terrible, but I don't care. I really love it. Okay, last my bag. So I was really confused what bag to get this year because like backpacks are great if you carry around a little stuff. And if you need like a brick, so I don't tend to like like backpacks. I have my Zoella one, which I love, which like I'll take out with me, but that one's not for school. That one's for like traveling and stuff. But I wanted one that's like more nice, still big. Like last year, I had a pug one. It's so cute, and the other like, I had a hype one, which ripped in like a week. <laughs> Like, by the time the year was finished, it was, like, a massive hole in it. I'm pretty sure it was, like, a really dodgy batch. Yeah. But I got this really cute little black like, Well, not really little. It's bigger than my face. Black handbag. This is really cute. It's £18. And it's pretty big. It's got, like, a little... It pops open, like... Wait. There's seats in here. Like, it pops open. And then you've got, like, two little zip sides and it's it's pretty big like wait let me show you i mean you can't even see the project book really that's it's pretty big but it's so nice and it's got like a extendable strap i think inside oh yeah here's the extendable strap it's got like an extendable strap here so you can have it like on your arm like up there or you can like, have it here, you know, just, just play whatever, whatever you want. I've got hair, again, I'm shedding hair today, what the flip? Okay, so that is all I've got for you guys today. Normally, a little bit giddy would be like, it's a giveaway time, I'm going to give away all this. I'm not, I need this all, this. I need all it, I need it all, I need it very important um but yes so i want to give you like a back to school series where every now and again i do like a video where i just give you guys back to school tips so i think next time i might do like a makeup tutorial maybe like a back to school makeup tutorial not this look there's like a look really heavy but like what i would wear for school or maybe a diys <gasps> should i do back testing back to school diys oh my god that'd be so fun I kind of want to do that, but then I have to buy stuff. Yeah, no. <laughs> um, I probably do like a makeup tutorial, maybe some other stuff. Who knows? Not me. But thank you so much for watching this video, guys. If you did enjoy, please make sure to smash that like. like bleh, bleh, bleh. Well, I did so well speaking this video, but then I go and like mess it up at the last part. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. If you did enjoy, please make sure to smash that like, love. 
I can't speak now. Wow. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. If you enjoyed, please make sure to smash that like button down below. Subscribe to my channel for awesome content, including beauty and gaming videos. And turn on your post notifications for my channel so you never miss an upload. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy. Comment down below if you're excited to go back to school or if you want me to do any more videos on this sort of stuff. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye, guys. Mm, bye.